What are internet sex crimes? Internet sex crimes can involve communications between people on any number of the digital platforms out there. So that can be on Facebook, Instagram, WhatsApp, WeChat, any of these platforms that are easily accessible by law enforcement, particularly the feds. So these platforms are often being watched, but what can happen is that a minor might get into a conversation with an adult, even if that person is only 18 and the minor is, let's say, 15 or younger and the 18 year old doesn't know that this person is a minor or isn't aware of the fact that this is extremely dangerous and illegal. So they will start getting into conversations, they'll ask each other to send pictures back and forth, and even sometimes ask to meet. And what will happen is if a parent catches wind of these conversations, they will call the police and then the police will pretend to be that person, the minor, on the phone, the adult will continue to send pictures and sometimes even ask to meet the agent or officer, which has happened in cases that where I've represented defendants who have actually end up, ended up going to meet with the minor and they were arrested at the meeting place. So be aware that the feds and local law enforcement do have access and they can get subpoenas and they can get WhatsApp records, even though you think that they don't last. Any kind of lewd communication. So you have to be really careful in knowing who it is that you're communicating with. Of course, the other kinds of sex crimes involve pornography, which we can talk about in another video. But these crimes, lewd conduct with a minor on the internet, can carry extensive prison sentences. So it is imperative if you are under investigation or if you have been arrested for any of these crimes to contact me, an experienced federal criminal defense attorney and a, federal, a state criminal defense attorney in California to represent you and to try to get the best possible outcome for you in these cases. Thank you.